Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific and crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle and this must be amongst the favored arenas of supporters all over the world it really does have a very special feel to it premio have opted for a 4-5-1 formation it appears jim well, the lone striker has to be prepared to do some of the work himself, but essentially he needs two of the three central midfielders to make runs beyond him and trust that the wide men can, can service the penalty box and make those link-up runs from out to in. He should get plenty of support with this setup. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. It's a decent ball. Shoots! A real chance and a real let-off. Quick thinking and quick control, Peter. That creates a, a little more working space. Flamengo have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Diego Tardelli gets into a dangerous position. No change to the score. Nil-nil it remains. Looks to clip it forward. Danger averted for now. Gabriel. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Diego Tardelli looks to get on the end of this. It's a long ball, and it's not hit its target. Little by way of goal mouth action yet. What a ball! Has a pop! And the ball's come out! And he's there to hoof it away. He's tried one! Fence has got rid of that. Going to be the final action of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. So they head in no further forward. The score here still nil nil. And the second half gets underway. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here.
He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. The ball has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Here's a corner. Chances keep on coming, they're awarded another corner. Repelled by the keeper. The clearance and very necessary. Throw. chances to talk of Jim defenses it seems on top here yeah I think it's a scoreline in keeping with what we've seen up to this point combined attempts at goal aren't high in numbers and we could do with something to spark this contest into life and here's Gabriel he's gone down but the referee just tells him to get back up again rather wayward well he did get himself into a good position something for him to cling to Another flank. It'll be a throw in. He's got the ball, he's tries a shot. So who's he picking out? Hoists it forward. Played out to the right. Flamengo merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. And it's played forward. Forward it goes. So that's it, it is all over. A frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a stiff. Defence is broadly in charge, and it has finished goalless. Your reflections then, Jim.